Hi, I'm Simon with AppliancePartsPros.com. Today we're going to show you how to repair your appliance. Are you ready? Remember, anytime you work on your appliance, make sure it's unplugged or the circuit breakers are off so there is no chance of electrocution. In this video, we'll show you how to replace the agitator in the Maytag washer. It's going to be a very easy repair, should only take a couple of minutes to show you how to do it. For this job, we're going to need a quarter inch nut driver. When you open up the package, you're going to get a new agitator. The agitator stirs the clothes inside the washer in a certain pattern, allowing them to get washed. The main reason why the agitator would need to be replaced is if one or more of its pedals breaks, causing torn clothes. Let's start with opening the lid. The agitator sits on the transmission shaft and is held on its side by one quarter inch screw near the base. The location of that screw is marked by two short parallel lines at the base of the agitator. Using the quarter inch nut driver, loosen up that screw. Grab the agitator by its base with both hands and lift it off the transmission shaft. Pull off the fabric dispenser from the old agitator and save it. This is the old agitator next to the new one. If you don't have this part, you can get it from AppliancePartsPros.com. Slide the new agitator onto the transmission shaft and make sure it's all the way down. Using the quarter inch nut driver, tighten the screw to secure the agitator to the shaft. Install the fabric dispenser on the top of the agitator and close the lid to check if it seats correctly. Looks like we're done here. Plug the washer in and stop buying new socks every week. Thank you for being a part of another successful repair brought to you by AppliancePartsPros.com. For any of your future appliance repair projects, please check out our other repair videos available on our site, on Facebook, and on YouTube.